So we had a gnarly, gnarly passage yesterday. Um, 11 and a half hours. We went over 50 miles. I don't know the exact mileage yet. Um, it was another kind of run day. We were planning on going from Bjorkor, which is an amazing place, to Fasia, um, up near uh, Natalia. But um, now it's a uh, Time to get the boat ready and we're gonna push for um, Stockholm and uh, that's where I got to catch the bus from in two days to um, go to the airport so uh, yeah but today's passage will only be a couple hours which is nice hopefully we can do it early it's like 5 five thirty in the morning right now so that's where we're at and uh, time to get the day going the name spins up yeah. and it was spinning faster when it was further away yeah. maybe he slowed down well, what is that's a boat <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ <laughs> We're tied up in Vaxholm, which is considered the either the gateway to Stockholm or the gateway to the archipelago, depending on which direction you're going. Um pulled in here I don't remember what time we got in um, but it's a proper like uh, guest harbor there's tons of slips um, it's first first come first serve there's showers restrooms tons of shops tons of restaurants and uh, it's, it's nice to actually be back around civilization um, we were in the wild for a long time and uh, and our food got real low so um, it's nice to to be back in the mix you know there's a massive fort here that's just across the water I'm gonna go check out 
Tomorrow morning we head out for Stockholm, which is not very far. Short sail. The sail today we we uh, kept all the sails down and just motored because the winds were between like almost nothing and 25 knots. Kind of anytime we got to where the channels uh, met, it was like crazy wind. Uh, and also, all almost all the boats we saw, especially later in the day, everyone had their sails down. So even the locals were were keeping their sails put away. But uh, yeah, I think all that that whole wind event was bringing in this front. Now uh, it's been raining on and off. It's pretty cloudy. So um, hopefully that'll pass. We'll see what it's like tomorrow. We we head off to Stockholm. And uh, tomorrow night, I catch a bus to the airport and fly home. It's been quite an adventure. We'll see what Stockholm has in store for us tomorrow. Uh, but for now, I'm going to go explore this city and see what it's all about.